crafting the rare longsword or the copper longsword. In this tutorial, I'm gonna to explain to you how to actually craft that copper longsword or rare longsword and what you're gonna need in order to make that happen. The first thing we're gonna to wanna to do is head to the desert biome and go into the caves. When you get here, you're gonna need some cool headed charms or you're gonna take damage from the heat. There's two cool headed charms and right here is what you're gonna to need to make those. I recommend at least two of those and then possibly snowberry shakes if you still are taking heat damage. All right, you're gonna need a smelter in order to make actual copper bars. So the first thing we're gonna need is obsidian and you're gonna have to make this into slabs. This is gonna be one of the things you need to make a smelter. If you cannot find obsidian, obsidian is found on top of the ceilings a ton. So you might actually have to build your way up to the obsidian and then break it down. Watch out though when doing this because sometimes you will break your builds and will fall off into the lava. You won't die from the lava though. The next thing you're gonna wanna do is find blast core. These lava rollers right here, drop blast core. They're rare in these caves, but you will find them. Next, you're gonna need bright core. Bright core is gonna be used to craft the smelter, but it's also gonna be one of the key components in the smelter to make copper bar. It takes two bright core and one copper ore, or copper bar to make one copper bar. Next, you're going to want to find copper. This is copper. It's going to have a copper color and then it's going to have a gray rock with like green around the copper itself. Once you have all these items, you're going to want to head back to your base and craft a smelter if you do not have one. Once you have a smelter, you're going to head over to it. You're going to click copper bar and you're going to place all your copper ore in one and you're going to place all your bright core in the other. After doing this, you're going to let it smelt. Once it's done and you've collected the bars, you're going to head over to your crafting bench, which you have to have at least a rare version of and you're gonna craft that longsword. Good luck and happy adventures.